This video was made possible by the EA Game Changers program. Hi everyone, it's Chrissy and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another Sims 4 speed build. So this is actually the last Sims 4 Cottage Living speed build that I did when I had the pack a couple of weeks ago as part of the like super early access kind of thing. So yeah, this was actually the last build that I did when I had the pack and it's the last build that I'm sharing as well. So yeah, it's another small cottage. This one is actually in the center of town, so in the Finchwick area. And it's built on a 20 by 15 lot. It only turned out to be, I think, just under 30,000 simoleons. So it's also kind of like a budget home as well. Even though I didn't really build it to be that. It just, you know, it was a happy coincidence that it turned out to be quite, you know, on a tight budget. And it's only one bedroom and one bathroom. And this was actually the last build that I did with my early access. So it's not super detailed. I kind of rushed it a little bit because... I knew we weren't going to have access for much longer and I wanted to see if I could, you know, complete another build. So yeah, this one isn't super detailed on the exterior. The interior still looks pretty nice, I think. It still looks like a fairly nice and detailed and like decorated cottage. Especially since, you know, it did end up only being like 30,000 simoleons. So it also kind of looks like I did intentionally build it on a budget. So... Yeah, that was again another happy like little coincidence. But yeah, so the interior is fairly decorated and like finished looking. But the exterior isn't like my best work, I don't think. I mean, I still like the way it turned out. It kind of looks like I, if I like intentionally did it a little bit more simplistic than I did all of the other builds that I did. If It kind of looks like I did it intentionally. Which I didn't, but I'm just going to go with that and pretend that I did. So yes, it was totally intentional, the fact that I don't have a ton of tiny little details all over the exterior of the build. That was completely intentional and I wanted to do something a little bit more simplistic. <laughs> so yeah, we're just going to go ahead and like say that and pretend that it's true. But yeah, so this is the last like early, early access build that I did, like I said. And that's also because this was part of that super early access kind of thing. That's why you will see my name popping around up on the screen. And also because I recorded this on a not final build of the game. It is subject to change. So everything that you see is subject to change. And yeah, that's just a disclaimer that I have to make. But next, not next week, what am I saying? It's actually tomorrow. When you guys are seeing this, you're going to be seeing this on the 20th of july i think yeah we're in july right yeah so you're going to be seeing this on the 20th of july but starting tomorrow on the 21st of july i'm actually going to be having more early access content for cottage living coming up so yeah i'm actually going to be getting the pack and we're actually going to be doing some more early access builds and stuff on the channel but this time i will actually have the full pack the completed pack in my game so in my own game with all of the other packs and everything like that whereas you know with these builds i was only working with the base game and cottage living but yeah so the video that you guys will be seeing coming up tomorrow will be with you know all of the packs in my own game i can go crazy i have no idea what i'm going to be doing because you know i don't have the pack yet when i'm recording this so I have no idea what I'm going to be doing, but it's going to be something, and I hope you all like it. And I really hope that you guys aren't tired of all of the cottage living videos at this point, because I have basically only been posting cottage living videos for the past, like, two weeks, like, week, week and a half, two weeks, around about. And then obviously tomorrow, all of the game changes, when you guys are seeing this, I guess I should say, all of the game changers will be releasing early access videos as well. Well, not videos necessarily, but like content, I guess I should say. And yeah, our embargo lists tomorrow. So we'll be able to start posting content from 10 a.m. Pacific time. So Wednesday, the 21st of July at 10 a.m. Pacific time is when you guys will see my first like regular early access video with the pack. And that's 1 p.m. Eastern time and I believe 5 p.m. GMT, I think. 
it's 7 p.m for all of us in south africa that's when the like embargo will lift so if you're in south africa then 7 p.m basically my usual upload time so yeah that's actually worked out really really well funnily enough so yeah that's something that i'm looking forward to i have no idea what i'm going to be doing because i have done so many builds with the pack already but I'm really looking forward to having it in my own game and being able to experiment with all of the other packs and just seeing how things work together, you know, cross-pack gameplay and all of that stuff. So, yeah, if you guys have any ideas for builds that you'd like to see, specific themes or, you know, even if you have, like, specific reference pictures that you'd like to see me, like, either attempt to, like, recreate or, you know, take inspiration from or whatever... If you have specific reference pictures, then link me to them over on Twitter, like post them on Twitter and tag me in it. Or if you just have like an idea, then definitely leave them below in the comments. I would love to see your guys' ideas because yeah, I have been scouring the internet and looking at like Pinterest and Google and all of that stuff for inspiration for builds and everything. And yeah, I would love to see what you guys would actually want to see on the channel. But yeah, so... Because of the fact that our other like regular early access will be starting tomorrow, I will also start uploading all of the builds. So I'll probably upload all of these builds that I did with like the early early access. I'll probably upload all of them at like one time. So if you follow me over on the gallery, apologies in advance for the spam of uploading that you will be getting. But yeah, I'm going to be putting these save files in my game. Hopefully they will work so that I can upload these builds. And yeah, then I will upload all of them to the gallery. They're all base game and cottage living only. So they should be great for those of you guys that, you know, are on a restricted pack build. Or, you know, you don't have all of the packs or whatever. So yeah, I will be uploading all of them to the gallery. And then I'll also update the description boxes for all of the speed builds to give you guys the gallery download link to that as well and I'll probably also make a community tab post telling you that you know everything is up on the gallery and you can go ahead and grab everything all of that stuff and then I will also be uploading all of the tray files for all of these builds for my channel members as well if you want to find out how to become a channel member then check out either the link at the top of the description or the join button that's right next to the subscribe button that will tell you exactly how to become a channel member and all of that stuff and the tier and everything like that that will allow you to get access to all of the tray files if that's something that you want to do and you don't want to like bother with the gallery or anything like that. But yeah, we're almost done with this build. Like I said, it was a fairly quick build. It didn't take me all too, too long. I mean, I did spend probably more time on the landscaping than I should have because I was... I just, I can't not do landscaping. But even the landscaping is a lot more, I don't know, I guess toned down than I did any of the other landscaping in my other builds. And here you will see that I did try and add in a pond, but the space was just too small and yeah, I just didn't feel like messing around with it for like too long. So I just end up getting rid of it and I end up adding in a chicken coop instead, I think. So yeah, that's basically the whole build. There's not much to it, like I said, it's more of a kind of starter cottage than anything else it's definitely not a like in-game kind of build it's definitely more of a starter kind of thing even though it is almost 30,000 I mean it's still it still looks like a starter let's put it like that it's still small and it looks like a starter so yeah it's still a smaller like on the smaller side but I hope you guys enjoyed this build if you did give the video a like and if you're new to the channel and you'd like to see some more sims content including some more early access content, then feel free to hit the subscribe button and remember to turn on the notification bell as well to be notified of whenever I upload a new video. Also, like I mentioned earlier, if you'd like to support the channel a little bit extra, then check out the link at the top of the description or the join button that's right next to the subscribe button to find out how you can become a channel member if that's something that you want to do and you're like financially able to do that. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And like I said, if you have any ideas or suggestions or anything like that, leave them down below in the comments. And I hope you're all having a great day and a great start to your week. And I will talk to you all in my very next video. Bye everyone.